Hi everyone. So I haven't been around much. Um, I got a lot of personal stuff going on. Um, but today I'm going to do something I don't usually, well, I haven't done in a while. And um, it's kind of hard for me to do. So I'll take a good look at my face. Um, I'm going to tell you what makeups I use today. Um, so lately, I've been really, really feeling um, pinks, pinks and like lavenders. Like I've been really feeling them lately. So that being said, um, I started experimenting more with them recent as of recently, and this is better lighting. Yeah, you can see my makeup better. I've been experimenting more with them as of recently, and this camera is not doing it justice. But on my eyes, I have a dark pink that fades into black. And um, under my brow, I have like a frost that I made. And man, this camera is giving it justice. Here we go. Now you can see. And on my lips, I have lipstick on Nicki Minaj's Pink Friday. Um, so I'm going to tell you a little bit about all of them. So. First of all, um, about my lips. Mm. I love lipstick, um, but I am a fan of nudes and pinks. I don't really like red lipstick. It doesn't look so good on me. I have to find the red for me. I think I need a darker red, and I only need a little bit of it. And my lips are like a nudish brown color as is. So I generally speaking only use like frost and stuff on my lips, not a lot of color. But um, as of recently, um, when I was a kid, well not a kid, but when I was a little younger, I used to be a big fan of Victoria's Secret Baby Doll, which is like, oh, like, bad example, but I guess a um, Pepto-Bismol pink. So, um, yeah, so it's like a Pepto-Bismol pink, and um, that's the color I've been feeling lately, again, like I've been feeling it. And I haven't been able to find, I don't think they even make Baby Doll anymore, but I always mix a color together to find, try and make it, and I usually use nude. So, anyway, so let's start with my lips. First of all, before I ever put on lipstick, I always put on a lip balm. I do it before I put on lip gloss, too. Um, unless the gloss is like a moisturizing gloss, but generally speaking, I always put lip balm on first. And I'm a Carmex fan, but another... One I like is I like Blistex, the red, the green too. I like that one. And I also like Aveda's lip balm. It's really good. It saves your lips in minutes. Like, lips save. But another one that I've discovered as of recently that I really like, and I think, I don't think I've shown you guys this, is Neutrogena. And this stuff, is that deal oh it just my lips are so nice right now like I put some on last night like I keep lip balm by my bed because I wake up and my lips just need moisture but um I put some on last night and my lips healed and then I put a little bit on before I put on this lipstick so anyways so I think I said did I say this already I'll say it again um, so I found a, a lipstick I like. Um, my mom had ordered a, bu a bunch of MAC makeup, and they gave her a free sample. Was it a free sample? I don't know. Doesn't matter. They gave her a sample of, are you ready? Even though I'm not a big fan of this person. Look, my nails are pink. It's Pink Friday. Um, Nicki Minaj's lipstick. And this is the best color ever. First of all, I love the lipstick too. I love lipsticks. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is Pink Friday. And I personally cannot use a lot of it unless I'm mixing together. Like right now, it kind of looks like I have milk and magnesia on my lips. But trust me, when I got, like, my gloss on over it, it's so much prettier. And when I first started out without putting that extra bit on, it was a lot nicer. So, I'm a huge fan of it. Um, and, yeah. So, that's enough about my lips and me rambling. Now for the eyes. Oh, and I'll do my face. Um, but, okay, so, for my eyes, 
I use um, this makeup kit. I think I've shown it to you before. It's from the beauty supply store. This. Look how much it was. They're cheaper other places, but with this one, and it's 24 colors. It's like the, it's like my everyday go-to. I use my MAC 180 palette when it's like a special occasion or I'm mixing like specific colors. But this is my everyday go-to makeup. And I've got other ones, but this is just the one I use today. So the color I use is, the main colors I use um, are through this center. And the color I used was that one, this pink. Hold on, can you see that? Yeah, this pink um, mixed with this pink. Anyways, well, I put this pink on first as a base, but first of all, I put a concealer on to hold the color a little better. It's just my brown concealer. I wasn't trying to make it, like, stand out too heavily today, but I wanted it to be a touch of pink. So I put the darker pink on first, and then I used this salmon color over it to give it a little bit of a sparkle. And that's throughout. I covered my whole, like, lid with it. And then in the corner, in the crease right here in that corner, I used this black you see right there I used that black and um, that gave me like a smoky eye look I only use a dab of it and it makes the pink a little darker so it actually almost looks purplish in the corners but it's black you can, if you look closer it's black so okay and then under my brows I cannot I'm sorry I see people who use the whole color all the way up I cannot use a whole color all the way up I have to I look I like it to blend out, so I use a lot of golds and browns up around my brow just to make it blend out, um, but some people don't. Um, if I'm going to a party or something like that, I'm less likely to, but um, that being said, the color I always use on my brow is um, a little bit of this gold mixed with that bronze. Well, today I didn't use that gold as heavily, I used like a dash of that gold on the top, but I use mostly this bronze and this color right here, which is kind of a, it's like a goldish gray almost. I guess it's more of a, I don't even know. But I use that under my brow and I mix it together and just blended it out. Real simple, real quick, didn't take me too long. And ta-da. So, now for my face. I am a dark-skinned individual. Not saying that you can't have light skin, this doesn't happen. But I scar from everything. And you can't tell in this, but my face, I have like little spots, dark spots. Happens to a lot of dark skinned individuals. Um, not just black women, just if you have a, more of a tan or olive skin, you just tend to scar. So, um, because my skin is so gentle or whatever, I try not to use heavy cakey things. So what I used on my face today was this concealer that I used on my eyes. I just did that for the spots on my face that I just wanted to cover up. Put a, just a weeny bit on it. And actually I had bought an NYX NYX stick or NYX or whatever you want to call it stick and I cannot find it. It was a concealer stick and that shit works wonders. Excuse me. So anyways, I use a little bit of this on my spot. Just a weeny bit. Take the shine off or whatever. And then I have <clears throat> these puppies. Now they might look like they're the same color in this camera. And actually, they're only like a shade and a half apart. You cannot really see the difference. Um, one of these is just more chocolate, and one's like a little more gold. And it's like different variations of tan. You can kind of see it a little bit. It's different variations of tan. And what I do is I have a summer, and I have a, a winter color. And in the winter, I like lose my color. I'm brown, but like in the winter, I'm like a light brown. And not light skin, but a light brown. So I had to mix together my color, and I can't use the darker bra um, bronzish colors that I use usually in the summer. So um, one of these is my summer color, and one of these is my winter color. And what I did is I put my summer color or my winter color on first, I put a concealer, and I went over it with my summer color. And I use very little makeup. I don't use a whole lot of this. I like to plug up my skin. And I like the fact that my skin doesn't feel way down and it's breathing when I use this and um I just kind of like um brushed it out and evened it out and I'm kind of matte right now I usually put a little bronzer over it but I'm not feeling it today so 
Um, and then I got little earrings in and my pearls on. And I'm really feeling pink lately. Like, I'm just pink from head to toe. I'm loving it. I will show you some of the stuff. I'll probably show you my outfit of the day or something. Some of the stuff that I've been getting for Christmas or whatever. Um, I got some a pink North Face. And I wear it under my black North Face. And I wear it with this scarf thing I have. And I'm obsessed, honey. Like, I love that look. I'll probably wear it again today. And you'll probably see me going to class with it. But... Anyways, not to be Nicki Minaj, but as Vestas, um, I, I, anyone who knows me, I'm not a fan of Nicki Minaj like that, but I will be the first to tell you, I bang with the lipstick. I'm loving it. So, anyways, um, bye y'all.